In 2017, misleading and maliciously false online content is so prolific that we humans have little hope of digging ourselves out of the mire. Instead, it looks increasingly likely that the machines will have to save us. That is literally what MIT Technology Review's associate editor for AI, Jackie Snow, wrote in a recent article entitled, Can AI Win the War Against Fake News? In the article, Snow profiles a startup called adverif.ai. The startup has built an algorithm to detect fake news, along with other problematic content like nudity and malware. They built the algorithm for ad networks and content platforms who want to make sure their products aren't associated with that menace to society, fake news. Because it's one thing for a user to read some crap news someplace, but it's a whole other for a product to be associated with it. We can't have that now, can we? I mean, imagine if your dishwashing soap ends up sponsoring an article with questionable facts. Blasphemy! Can't have that! So that's why adverif.ai is making their little robot software in order to detect that fake news. Not to protect humanity from false information, but to protect brand images. And one of the ways they do that is by scanning content for telltale signs that something's amiss. An example Snow gives is when the headline doesn't match the body. That's something they are leaving up to the robots to detect. When I read that, I literally laughed out loud because the headline never matches the body of an article. If a robot blocks content because it doesn't match the headline, there won't be any content left anywhere. CNN, The New York Times, Fox News, all of them, they will all be left with nothing because the headlines almost always, and I mean always, are misleading. The article mentions other companies rushing to make artificial intelligence that can recognize false information too. And of course, it mentions Facebook and Google. Snow mentions a bunch of other companies that are getting in on the robo fact checker game too. It's a big business because according to a study they mentioned, the majority of people in advanced economies will see more false than true information by 2022. And the whole story comes down to this that we humans have no ability to figure out what's true or not on our own. So we must now entrust the truth to robots. That is the fact that isn't actually written in this article, but I could spot it anyway. And I didn't even need a robot to tell me how ridiculous that is.